Good evening, good evening everybody. I hope everyone is well this fine, fine Wednesday evening. We are precariously stood on the on the end of this bit to get a nice view of Beauty Bay. Beauty Bay and Booty Bay. But it is a beauty as well. Look at the view with the moon and everything. I really like it here. Skitchio, good evening, how are you? Thanks for stopping by. And Wave, how are you both? And thank you for the follows that came in just then. I had a huge run of absolutely loads of follows for... A very weird one that was, but thank you all for the follows. Very kind of you. Doing very well, thank you. Um, Elvadurian, how are you? Thanks for stopping by. Alright, well, let's head down to our usual mailbox now. Let's get off my mount so I make less space for everyone. Oh, not the guild bank. We need the mailbox. Right. Um, Scarthis, uh, Zelania, uh, Freeside, Michael, uh, Recom, Ephemu, Amin, Anime, Leech, Soft Cell, Lucandra, Carnus Thrace, and Zeric, and Eating Games, and Kakabar. Thank you all for the follows. Uh, good evening, Jack. And Costa, how are you both? How's your past couple of days been? Hope all has been good. Right, let's have a look at the mailbox. Bags off. Open mail. We got some expires. So let's start with the expires and do those. How about me? Doing very well, thank you very much. Uh, busy couple of days at work, but um, been uh, successful, which is always good. Oh, I leaned far away from the mic while you turned the sound up. <laughs> oh, I do apologise, yeah. I had to bring it with me then when I was reading out all the follows. Apologies for the sudden loudness. So I'll wait for the mailbox to come through. It's a shame the um, the timer's not there anymore. I quite like that being there. It'll let you know when the, the mailbox is going to refresh. Um, one to fork, how are you? Thanks for stopping by. Um, you're buying orbs of mystery for seventeen thousand each, and the vendor price is twenty twenty thousand. That's a that's a lot for a vendor item, isn't it? But that's easy easy profits. There we go. So what have we got here? Hero's belt. What was that? Oh, that was um, the items I sent from. El Morte to uh, Disenchant. Let's have a look. We've got some sales in here, so let's have a look. Traveller's Backpack, Lavish Feasts, Few Enchants, oh, uh, a load of stuff's just expired. So, Rich Bevel Silk Shirt, that's a good one. More rings, Nomi Snacks sold. Now, I did put a load of food stuff on yesterday, and even the vendor stuff is selling, as well as the Lavish Feasts. So that's pretty good. 19,000 in the mail. I'll take that, definitely. Uh, hey, uh, Foku and uh, Tent Fungula, how are you both? Doing very well here, thank you very much. Just going through the mailbox, 20,000 in this one. So I think that's quite nice. And all the expires are just coming in now. How much bag space have I got for these? I can get a few, and then I'll have to uh, post these back on the auction house. Yeah, I can get, a, get those in, and then let's stay, step a bit forward, and then... Ah, now I changed my my default setting, I need to change that. Hold on. Let's go back to the Samadan profile. There we go, all the groups are back. And we'll run a post scan on everything. Yes, there we go. Um, bet my alts have better mailboxes. Yeah, that's going to be interesting, actually. My alts will be uh, hopefully outperforming my main, which is interesting. Um, Huxneva, how are you? Thanks for stopping by. How have you been? Well, it'd be nice if they all total up to more than 50,000. So 20,000 from Samadan, and then maybe another 10,000 from each. That's probably quite optimistic, though. We'll see how it goes. 
spending more money than you're making. Well, it happens sometimes. I actually, for the first time yesterday, um, because I was buying up a few things I needed to finish off my food, I actually ended up uh, spending more money than I made yesterday. And so for the first time on my graph, I actually went down by a notch, just a very small notch. Um, you can't quite see it here on the graph, but I was down by 3,000 at the end of yesterday when I did a quick check on everything. So that was a that was a first since I started this. Hey Thorinori, how are you? Thanks for stopping by. How's your Wednesday? Is it Wednesday? Yes, it is Wednesday. Reset day. I forgot about that. All right, let's post this lore on. Hopefully we can get some uh, enchant sales in this. I'm doing okay, thank you very much. It's still warm here in the UK, so struggling with the temperatures a little, but it's, uh, I think it's quite nice, all in all. Uh, Gregor, how are you? Thanks for stopping by. It's too warm. Yeah, it is that. Um, I was saying names at the beginning of all new followers. Yes, that's right, Jack. Um, just before I started, I had a mass flurry all at the same time of about 10 people all coming in, which is unusual. Normally people come in at different um, different moments, but for, to have 10 all at once was, uh, was quite cool. So uh, thank you for that, everyone who followed. It's definitely going up. I'm getting lots of expires coming through, so we're going to have to do another batch. Um, what I might do is see if I can clear some bank space to get a few more of these coming through. So how's my reagent uh, bag looking? Oh, we've got some space here. Let's deposit all reagents. There we go. And that will give me a bit of space. I've still got a lot of stuff here though. Really need to sort that out a bit more. So let's get the expires. Let's get another lot done at least. You know, I'll just keep an eye on my free bag space, see if I can get another lot of mail in. It looks like we're going to have to do a full a full repost and reset by the looks of things. So, which is good. You know, it needs to be done every couple of days. So let's go through these, see how quickly we can post these on, and then see what else we can get in terms of sales. The enchants being on is the main thing, and then I can restock. I mean, it's a bit tricky to restock now that the gathering button's gone, but I found a way to just keep an eye on what's in the gather window and what you need, and then um, doing doing sort of like manual grabs of the things I need. Hey, forever, how are you? It's coming home. Oh, is that a uh, football reference? Is it? I, I have noticed England doing very well. My two teams in my uh, work sweepstake have both gone out, so um, Iran and Argentina are no more in my sweepstake, so I won't be winning winning that one. Not that I know anything about football. It was a random choice. There we go. Let's post another 50 on. Run through those. Massive turkey leg, that shouldn't be on there. I might need to um, clean out, well, <laughs> the same way as I need to clean out my guild bank and my regular bank and my regular bags, I also need to clean out some of my groups. It's almost like I need to spend a day it was sort of like in quietness going through and just tidying things up. But knowing me, it'll, it'll probably just get to get messy again. Post another lot, run the scan. Actually, what I'll do, I'll cancel that. I'm going to take the food off because um, it's quicker. Because there's so many multi multi posting options in the groups, it's easier just to ignore those and stick with these ones. As we've done it once in this session already. Um, always wonder when someone buys my auction, uh, they get the item right away, you have to wait one hour for the gold. Yeah, maybe maybe it's Blizzard's um, K 
counting the money and um, skimming off their profits perhaps anything that takes time but thanks for stopping by Molten Vaults it's a, yeah, it's, it's a weird one isn't it it's my gold and I need it now So you started selling uh, Crafted Transmog, 300,000, wow, you sold it for 300,000, you made 300,000, that's a great amount Jack, congratulations on that. Uh, done that, another lot, oh we don't have another lot, okay, I bet you there's more coming in the auctions though, yeah here it is, I've gone ahead of myself, so let's manually cancel these ones. Oh, you paid 300,000 for materials. Aha, right, yeah, that's... Well, uh, hopefully the transport comes through. Hey, Adonria, how are you? My day's going very well, thank you very much. Looking forward to a nice bit of chill gold making tonight. Once I've got all my auctions back on, that is. And checked everyone else's mailboxes. Which is probably going to take me a little while. Um, War God Stompy, how are you? What are we going to teach us today? Now... I haven't really thought about what I'm going to do today, other than the regular, the regular gold making, um, auctioning, reposting, um, maybe a bit more with El Morte and the mining. Possibly, uh, we'll do a bit more Half Hill Farm with J Awakening. Try and get the alchemy a bit more rounded up. Um, you did that when you first started with TSM, still trying to sell the transmogs. Yes, yeah, some of them, some of them have been on for a while. Um, if you'd farm it, you'd still be going. Yeah, that's the thing. Buying the mats, you know, does does save you time, which is what it's all about as a goblin. Time is money. Although, you've got to factor in fun as well. And that's, you know, that's something you just got to balance out with time and everything else. Three million return is very nice. Right, another lot, another lot to post on. Well, I've got a couple more there that could probably do with being cancelled, and then we'll post on the rest. The quick post scan. So, how does cloning work again? <laughs> yeah, that would be handy. Well, there we go. First two sales in, two critical strikes. Profit margins on enchants are nowhere near as high as they used to be, but I'll take, I'm only making them if they are a profit, so I'll take that. Um, teaching the day is to enjoy the challenge. Excellent, War God. That's a good point. Enjoy the journey as much as anything else. And I like a good challenge because it keeps you focused. Yeah. Well, the thing is, I guess um, if you if you can sell it and you don't, you know, cripple yourself in auction house costs in the time it takes you to sell it, it's you know it's something that's there as long as it's easy enough to repost. Which thankfully with TSM, it is pretty easy. Just going to get rid of all of these things. Although I probably wouldn't want to have too much here. Oh, good evening, Clinda. How are you? Thanks for stopping by. How's your Wednesday? Oh, and happy 4th of July to all the um, American viewers. I forgot about that. Let's post another lot on. Dark Moon Turtle for 19,000. Barbarian Spear of the Soldier for 12,000. That'd be nice if that sells. Expedition Bag. I haven't sold one of those for 49 days. I wonder if I'm ever going to sell any more of those. Depends with pre patch and everything. Wait for the pre patch to load up on some stuff. Love how the material gets dirt cheap for a couple of weeks. Then crafted toys, pets, and mount skyrocket shortly afterwards. Yeah, it does, it does seem to have its uh, peaks and its troughs, doesn't it? Ah, uh, Perkin, how are you? Finally caught me a little bit earlier before you're going to sleep. Oh, excellent, Perkin. Well, thanks for stopping by. Glad you could make it. 
Um, we're just going through and reposting our auctions at the moment and then we'll move on to potentially some other bits and pieces, um, some recrafting of things if the TSM task list is going to be playing ball with us we'll see how it goes, we may have to do things a bit manually right, that's all the mail and that's all the cancels so this is the last post scan going to have some smoked salmon with the family, oh that does sound good nice bit of smoked salmon is always good um, always sell in the end, better to craft sooner than later yep, yeah. and if even if 50% of it sells then you know you're you're in for a winner. What's that in the background? That's a great big enormous mammoth. I need to get me one of those. Oops, click the wrong thing. My right mouse button's playing up a little bit. Where's the auction here again? There we go. Right, let's do another post scan. There we go. You bought Pierre for sixty-five thousand. Um, on your side round where you just sold drums, very nice way, very nice. Um, when was it that? Oh, I missed that one. Uh, Blizzard will only support WoW in 64-bit. 18th of July. Oh, I don't know about that. That's an interesting one. Oh, you you bought the plans for a Felsteel Longblade. Excellent. Um, yeah, good luck on the sales on that one, uh, Kalinda. It's always nice when you, you do something like that, because it is an investment, um, but it's something you can f make forever now, which is always the good thing. Um, I've got that with the rich purple silk shirt. If I had bought that, which thankfully I didn't, I would be in a similar position. I was like that with the Crusader enchant, though. I bought that for a, quite a high price, and it took me at least 10 to 20 um, sales before it even made its own. You got 32k on your realm forever, that's nice. Hey Ghost Pants, how are you? Um, thanks for stopping by. Don't forget the old mining ores, they will skyrocket when BFA hits because the revamp of leveling profession skills, yes, that's a good point actually, I've got a feeling they will. Um, and people are talking about doing um, profession kits and what have you. Um, I'm not sure whether that's something I would do because of the whole um, having to sell it in trade chats, not normally my kind of thing. Right, let's just check the auctions. Probably could do with just checking the Legion enchanting materials just to see if it is, what price everything is at and what stock I've got. So, Chaos Crystals, how many have I got? 136. Leylight, I've got 76. And Arcana, I've got 239. Well, let's see what we need to restock first, and then we'll see how much we need to buy. Don't think in the first two to three months uh, people will be levelling, yes. Oh, that looks like it's uh, corrupted. Uh, let's do a... Oh, let's just click it here. That didn't look a very healthy screen. I should have print screened that one to send to the team. That's a weird one. It didn't throw an error, but it did. Uh, all these two things I need to disenchant actually, because they've got a good a disenchant value of 47 and 108. So let's disenchant those two. What do we get? Rich illusion, illusion dust, and greater eternal essence. Okay, not so bad. Not so bad. Um, and so we're going to enchanting again and we need to look at our groups and restock on enchanting now the the list doesn't appear although the profit has appeared so we need to click on crafting reports wait for ages and then click back on crafting and that should work ah from the vault yes uh, Lindorfin that's a good idea um, At the moment, you can mine anything at any skill level, but when they change the um, professions to be expansion specific, I wonder how that's going to work if you haven't got the skill level in that um, particular expansion. The new patch comes and the price will go up until BFA because the new professions. Yes, I think that's right because they don't. They 
are they they're doing the stat squish and all the profession squish at pre-patch time is so I'm led to believe um, so yeah it's gonna be interesting oh, I've got cooking on as well interesting okay so well it looks like according to this I can make everything so let's start with those I'm probably going to need some temporal crystals I don't think this is going to be enough for everything but we'll see we'll go through and now it's stuck on those let's make the ones we can next now it's updated to be read there there's the temporal crystals that are missing takes a little while and there we go we're missing arcana now and uh, when you hit the level for that patch uh, you'll get one in that stat okay uh, and then people can then farm for things in that that would make sense um, people can easily farm it now because because we are done with legion yeah that's true is pretty much everyone's just doing filler things at the moment until they've got um, you know until the pre-patch hits the new levels will take a hundred epic grass for them to get maxed after BFA launch because people won't focus on it yeah I can imagine people there's going to be a, obviously a rush for new content that's going to be the things uh, greetings Ignis how are you and so we're going to need some more arcana by the looks of things and a little bit of temporal crystals so what can I it's probably worth me actually buying arcana where's my arcana it's probably in the um Let's have a look on this. Um, run a shopping scan. Excellent, good to hear, good to hear. We're just going through and restocking on our enchants at the moment, hoping for some good sales today. I don't know how much people are bothering with reset day these days now, because obviously people are thinking, okay, well, you know, there's not much point because everything's going to change very soon. So the crafting cost of this from the um, the averages that I've got my map cost is at 9 gold 67 whereas purchase price is at actually 6 gold 64 so I might as well buy this how much do I need I've got very little so I'm gonna take that and I'm gonna take the two lots of 200 may go down more for old content stuff because you don't need profit till BFA um, until BFA content. Yeah, I mean, how many have got ley light? Well, I'm going to get those ley light. And I'm going to get those chaos crystals because I'm down to 64. There we go. So that's me stocked up a little bit better. 469, 198, and 216. Obviously, that's cost me a little bit in gold. Um, but let's pick those up and then we can make some profits on those hopefully our oh, temporal crystals we need so let's do one of these and then when Legion came out all old content stuff that wasn't used for mounts went way down at least in your server yeah I wonder how much it's going to differ per server as well that's another factor um, still need some more temporal crystals. Let's make these first, the bindings of haste. We can make those. And then we're going to make um, one gift of critical strike. So we need some temporal crystals. What's the price for buying them? Going to see a roller coaster. Yeah, roller coaster I think is a good, a good um, analogy. Um, what are we looking at? 26%. My average purchase is 25. Matt cost is coming from luminous shards of 9 gold, so not at 24 gold. So that's my daily cooldown. Um, so, but my purchase price is 25, so that is slightly higher. There we go. The wooden shards do, yes, thanks to uh, Ignis suggesting it. I basically got all the, I got one each of them, and I'm getting sales of them. So it's just a question of actually making sure I've got enough temporal crystals, which is my bottleneck at the moment. Otherwise, I'd be crafting more of them. So if anything under... What was temporal crystals? 25 gold. So anything under here, I'm worth buying these. 
So I'm going to buy all of these up. Anything under two gold fifty. I could have bid on those ones, but I'll I'm going to take that two tens there and the 13 and the 4 of 1 I'm going to take all of those I have got a work order in the queue but, oops, wrong button sometimes it's easy just to grab them from the auction house that's why you should hold on uh, have your old content resources when it rockets you can capitalise on it yep, I'm always a hoarder hey Shantajin, how are you? doing very well here, thank you very much just going through restocking of enchants. I've got a whole load of uh, fractured temporal crystals I need to make into proper ones. So I'll run through those. And then that should give me enough for my last enchant that I need to make. And then I'm going to put those back on the auction house. And then cooking's the only tricky one I may not be able to restock on. Um, so let's just make that one move that back up, gift to critical strike, then I can clear the queue of this lot, this is old, and then post that lot on. Let's run a post scan, there we go. Your big gold for enchanting is from the Mark of the Satyr. Yeah, I think people use that one still for levelling. I've had some good sales of that myself, and it's one of the ones that um, has good profit margins as well, usually. You're stockpiling cheap bear tartare. The problem with that one, Shantagen, is isn't it going to be nerfed? So I wonder how much benefit um, people will get from it. Although, it may not get nerfed. You never know with Blizzard. But if people are running through um, if people are running through Legion still using Bear Tartar, will it still be useful then? That's the question, I wonder. I guess no, you'll be you'll be at higher level. But um Hmm. Oh it goes down to zero percent, okay. It scales badly then. Yeah, well, it'll be interesting to see what does come out from it. Alright, that's done. So I'm going to just do the tailoring restock. This is where things might get interesting. A lot of this is um, ember silk, which I don't have, and shadow weave, which I don't have. Hex weave bag, I uh, could probably do once I do a cooldown, which I've run out. Okay, so. Here's the thing, things we need to do now. Run out of sumptuous fur. Um, currently looking at four gold 40, which is way more expensive than my normal purchase price. So I'm gonna need to farm some sumptuous fur. We're out of shadow silk, so I'm going to need to farm some shadow silk. We're, we've, for a long time we've been out of ember silk, and I really think I should get back into that ember silk market, because that did sell. Um, I have Thoranori. It's uh, a bit rough around the edges, to say the least. Uh, what happened to the Legion stat flasks? Uh, I think they'll just get nerfed or become useless. No idea, Perkin. Um, not sure on that one. Legion 70%, BFA pre-patch 30%. Okay, thank you, Ghost Pants. Uh, for some just for use garrison resources when they are 16. That's very good, uh, one type I do do that when it comes through. Um, it's probably worth a check of that at some point. Um, but I'm not sure I really have enough garrison resources to meet my need of everything that I need, because I do go through a lot of sumptuous fur. So there's there's a there's a thing for the things that I could possibly do tonight. Um, there's a few little farms. Uh, today it's leather for the drums. Ah, okay, thank you, Costa. That made you very happy. Well, there we go. There's a sale in. So we've got some good things coming up so far. Um, 
let's see what we can do with the tailoring. What can we make? Um, that's all amber silk. That's shadow silk, which we don't have. We've got the swashbuckler's shirt and a rich purple silk shirt. We can do those at least. So let's take this off and see how the task list copes with two items. So for gathering, we need black dye, purple dye. Um, now my source one should really be guild bank and my lower source should be um, vendor. Really. I want to do a guild bank before those. So let's just close that down and reopen it. See if that sorts itself out. No, it still says vendor. Okay. Maybe if I take that off, remove. Let's do a reload, see if that works. Okay. Might be worth saving for lev leveling. You never know. Um, if start recruiting extreme scavengers. Oh, Danny, thank you ever so much for the... Uh, Oh, there was a goal, was there? <laughs> Thank you ever so much for the cheer. That's amazing. Thank you ever so much for your support. Really, really kind of you. I don't know who's playing at the moment, but cheering for a goal is fantastic. Uh, extreme scavengers, uh, you never have to farm beast hide or sumptuous fur. Yeah, I did start with the um, extreme scavengers. I'm not entirely sure how that works yet, Wave. I'll need to go and have a look at that. Um, Foreign will be a market for these. The fell scale anchor, laystone hoof plates, and the stirrups. So are they all to do with um, mount speed, Jack? I think the stirrups are, aren't they? Uh, oh, <laughs> there goes my auctioneers. Okay. So let's have a look. What can we do now that our auctioneers are dead? We were doing this. Okay, now it all says Guild Bank, which is what I wanted. So let's do a slash TSM task list. And we've got some daily cooldowns in here, but we've got the get from Guild Bank. Let's minimize this one. Get from Guild Bank is working. So let's move this down and see if by. Oops, just down there in the corner. Let's open up the guild bank and see if this works. Black dye, nine silk cloth, and another one. I can hear something going in the background. But it looks like it's stopped at one of them. Let's close this and open it up again. Still says moving now. Okay, let's try a reload. Where's my button gone? There we are. Uh, what did I miss? Uh, mount speed and being mounted whilst doing professions. Thought the buffs all specified broken aisles for those. Ah, oh, right, okay. Um, there could be new, new equivalents, yeah. Uh, you need to have a nice army of extreme scavengers before you see a difference. It takes about three weeks to get to the point, so if you log in every day once. Okay, Wave. So basically, does everyone have to be extreme scavengers? Not fully sure how it works. Okay, uh, that's over there, so that's a bit difficult. So now we've got two items. Let's try and move again. Will you pick up the nine bolts of silk cloth? Yes, you do. Now, will you do the black dye? No. Okay. So it looks like you have to do a reload for every single item. Which, to me, is a little bit inefficient. Uh, switch tabs while it's moving. Oh, okay, Jack, I'll try that. Does that work? Is that a, is that a good workaround? Uh, that worked for you a bit. Okay, well, unfortunately, I've only got one left now, but let's do the one and see how it goes. Uh, that over there. Black dye. Will you pick that one up? Yeah, okay. Well, we've got it for now. We've got the items we need. 
So let's do our tailoring of our two items. Just sold a binding of haste, that's pretty cool. Now we have to redo our crafting queue, so click on crafting reports. Yeah, this is uh, this is the bit of the, the beta where it's uh, rough around the edges. Just because they've introduced new things, um, it's bound to break things for, uh, for people. So once they've sorted these out, it'll be much, much smoother again. Keep looking for new ones. Um, some can double a scavenge trade with extreme one. Double the scavenge trade with an extreme one. Right, okay. One quest gives you about 2.8 to 3.6 thousand resources. Okay, that does sound good. Uh, I can't post these on because they've got no auctioneers. Which is the slight disadvantage of Booty Bay. Um, now, I'm not going to do cooking because uh, that would take me forever. And I'd have to do it manually. Uh, good evening, Gold Queen. How are you? Thanks for stopping by. The goblins are sleeping as well. Yep, sleeping on the job. They're all drunk. Fourth of July. Fourth of July. July. Yeah, it seems to be. That's a bit of a weird one, isn't it? They're all sleeping, and our auctioneer friend hasn't come back yet. So what I'll do is, rather than wait around, as I'm going to carry on with my other routine bits, I've got a couple of um, quests to pick up, I've got some eggs to pick up, and we need to go to our garrison as well. So let's start with Dalaran. Have a look, see what we can do. Right, so off to know me first. Do I have a bot to tell you what my basket tank is? Oh, I don't ghost pants actually. Um, but it's uh, Samadan2206. If uh, anyone's more than welcome to join in. Right, here we go. So. I'll have to sort one of those out. Some slightly burnt food. So let's do some new wildfowl eggs, create all, Next one is on and then we'll sell the slightly burnt, not the coffee, where is it, there it is, slightly burnt, no junk in that one, there we go. Hey right one two and JWR, how are you both? Thanks for stopping by. Finally caught me live, oh thank you ever so much, it's very kind of you to say so. Right, one, two, you again. <laughs> right, and we need to go and do our order hall missions because one of these is the uh, Centenax. Before I do that, I'm just going to have a quick check of the map. We've got an invasion on. There's a 10 bacon there. That could be nice. Um, and then, but it's probably not been worth doing those right now when I've got other things to do and other characters to check out. It's interesting how my gold making routine has changed slightly now that I've got more characters to deal with. I can't imagine how it is to deal with um, even more than the four I've got. Right, completed missions. Nether Shards, seven and a half thousand. And, oh we didn't get the bonus for that one unfortunately. And we're pretty low on order hall resources actually. So uh, there's no gold missions anyway. So what we'll do is we'll go, probably go hand in our nether shard. Maybe it's worth doing those, um, that bacon one, to get a few order hall resources at the same time. Bacon is, um, I bought some recently. Um, it's about 20 to 40 gold-ish. So for 10 bacon, you know, that's 400 gold. A saving for a small trip out. I I can do that. It's down to like five gold on your server. Wow, that is that is uh, super cheap. There's that one, and then I could possibly do that one. Give me some nether shards as well. And I'll miss that one. 
So what we'll do is we'll get a regular... Where's me? Which way am I facing? Go right. Not there. Over here. There it is. In the corner. I want to just get a flight path because it'll be easier. And I can get myself some more water at the same time. Right, where are we at? And bacon. Actually, let's do the, the big one over here first. And then we can fly over. Right. Whilst that's going, I'm just going to top up my water and I should be back. Discord Jack gave a special 4th of July dance. <laughs> I have to check that later, but that sounds cool. Um, what else we got? Um, mime on EU. Yes, that's right, uh, Ghost Pants. More characters, more rabbit holes you find during your logging the characters. Yeah, I mean, I've already got loads to do with Samadan um, and very little playtime. Orchard saw the Tom Tom add on. I've heard of that one, JWR. Um, it's supposed to be quite good, isn't it? Um, it's like, uh, helps you navigate around the world with coordinates and things, because I'm, I'm rubbish with coordinates. We're gonna just head over, get this one lot, Largoth. have a look. Uh, just going past the characters, order hall, garrison, emissary, takes you close to 10 hours a day. Wow, that's loads. What am I doing today, Gold Queen? Um, we are doing, it's very good and lightweight. Okay, I'll have to check it out, uh, JWR, definitely. Um, we are, this is a slight deviation from what I was planning on doing. Uh, just to get myself a bit more order hall resources, because I'm down to a thousand. Um, we've done our reposting of everything. I'm I'm going to have to do some farms, I think. So I need to do sumptuous fur. I need to do shadow silk, and I'd like to do ember silk as well. But first and foremost, I go, need to go through and check all my characters. So there's a kind of like a string of different things I need to do today. A lot of it's kind of maintenance. Right, where are you? This way. A Larthog. I wonder if there's a group for it. You saw this and thought of me. <laughs> yep. There you are. Um, how tough are you? Okay. I've got an extra friend. Is this soloable? Let's do some AoE first, because we seem to have got a few friends. And see, oh, I've got we've got a friend coming in anyway. There we go, let's run through this. This is definitely me going on squirrel hunts. Definitely. Let's close this down. We don't want to phase accidentally. There we are. Ooh, where's that gone? There we go. Laugh hog, there we go. By the way, um, there's a weekly event quest in Dalaran. Complete 20 world quests and get 5,000 audible resources. Oh, I didn't know about that one, Wave. Um, what's that for, um, Costa? Did I miss something? This is including the crafting and revising. So I ask for a squirrel to be named after you at the sanctuary. <laughs> that would be awesome. There we go, we've done that one. Slab of bacon. Now let's get a flight whistle and then we can get another flight over. There's usually someone nearby. 
Oh, how many order hall resources did we get for that one? Uh, 250, so it's not a lot really. We did get 350 nether shards though, so that's definitely cool. Um, and so we'll fly over to this one Beware. to pick up this one. There we go. Uh, you don't need to accept it in Dalaran. Okay, Drop Pencil. That's cool. Oh, and, and hello, Drop Pencil. I haven't seen you in ages. How are you? You can accept that quest from the Adventure Guide. Okay, well, let's have a look. Um, achievements. Quest Log. Where's Adventure Guide? Adventure Guide. Um, for increased rewards for the duration of this bonus event. This one, I guess. Complete 20 world quests, Broken Isles. Accept. There we go. Cool. Thank you, Drop Pencil, for that one. And wave. If you get a bear in the sanctuary, uh, call him Grills. <laughs> yeah, we've got it. Thank you, Jack, for the help. So 20 world quests, we've already done one. How long would it take me to do 20? I mean, an extra 5,000 order hall resources. I mean, this is a typical squirrel for me. How long have I got to do it in? Is it a week? Um, doesn't have a time on it. But we'll, uh, we'll see how that goes. I have until next Tuesday, okay. Uh, okay, thank you. That's three quests a day, okay. Oh, did I miss a question, uh, Shantagin? Where was it? Uh, let me scroll up. Du -du -du -du. Uh, did I get the question you redeemed? No, I think I missed one there. Um, I can't see one in chat, Shantajun. If you want to ask it again, feel free to go ahead. Uh, da, da, da. You did the redeem thing. What's that? Um, redeem what? I'm a bit confused. Um, better do it every day the emissary. Okay. That's every day a bunch of stuff in the chest. Okay. You don't have bears in the Netherlands. Right, Binding of Haste um, has just sold, which is cool. Let's go find ourselves a well-fed something. We've got foxes. Foxes are cool. Are you down there or over here? We do. It's in the zoo. <laughs> and cows. Wow. Electro shock. Interesting. Well fed muskin. It's not one, we don't need that one, don't need that one. Love the music here, yeah, it's really nice. There we are, all done. The slab of bacon, there we go. Um, when you hover over my stream, there is a mini icon. When you click on it, it says you could ask a question for points. Oh, really? That's a strange one. I wonder what that's about, Shantajin. I've never heard of that. It's a mini icon, and when you click on it, it says you could ask a question for points. Hmm. Oh, is it my Streamlabs extension? Okay. Is that a new one? Yeah, okay. Well, thank you, Shantajin, for letting me know that. I hadn't realised that was on. That's very strange. Um, I'm assuming you've seen so much good and you're so patient and humble. Oh, thank you, JW. That's very kind of you. I'd have to add it, would I? Okay. <laughs> I'm even more confused then. So we're done. I'm not going to do all the things here. I mean, that uh, would be nice if we could get a group going on that, but I don't think. I would 
really for that one. Scourge of the Skies. Does anyone fancy doing that one? I mean, this is a bit of a squirrel one. Oh, thank you, uh, Zach Tizzle, uh, for the cheer. That's very kind of you. You see a little pig of sand, bottom right corner of the stream. Is that what you're talking about? Okay. Always join a public group for it. Yeah, let's have a look and uh, see what's going on. Let's go fly over and we'll see. Oh, sliding down a tree. That's not good. Uh, Scourge of the Skies. Click to start searching for a group. No group found. Click to start one. Let's see if anything actually comes up. Uh, if you can't see the question, you just type it here. Okay. Um, it says open access dialog. Sharkin says I'm the man to watch. That's very kind of Sharkin. Sharkin is an extremely kind um, supporter. And Sharkin is also an awesome streamer. Won't do that one. Ah, this one. This one's the tough one, I remember. And whether we actually get enough people for this one. Uh, you brought a gregarious grell for 219,000 and six hexy bags. Now you're officially close to broke. Ah, that's a shame. 219,000, wow. What's a gregarious grell, uh, Foku? What does it do? It says open access dialogue. Okay, very strange. Oh, it's a TCG pet. Ha, ah, I see. That explains the rarity then. Right, okay, I don't think we're going to have... Oh, someone's gone for it. I'll try and heal them. Where are you? Yeah, is that 99%? We'll try it. Those people are going in for it. I'll see if I can help out as everyone's going for it. Hold on. Right. It looks like we might be... Uh, as everyone's doing it solo, this isn't going to work. And I'm going to hurt myself a lot. <laughs> this is a bad idea. Let's move away from this carnage. Um, basically, you looked up Bear Tartar and BFA. Scourge, Dire Stalker, Nithog. Where are you? Okay. Or heal. And uh, just, just heal the tank, and you get credit. Ah, oh, okay. Fair enough. Let's see if I can help out. Who's nearby? You're not on my side, unfortunately. You are over there, though. Can I help you out? Hold on. Come back. Hold on. Oh, that hurt me. Right, let's give you a blessing and a prayer amending. No, I can't do that in the same group. Okay, this is going to be interesting. Healing people who are not in a raid group. Okay, this is going to be easy. Good evening, Jeff Brown. How are you? Please pardon me whilst I'm running around trying to heal random people whilst not in a raid. Oh no, not smite. Wrong heal spell. There we go. Let's try and help people out here. They're all going for it. Give myself a bit of a heal at the same time. You're selling loads. Is that bear tartar? We're just trying to help out here as much as we can. It's a bit of a, it's a bit of a uh, carnage. Oh, can't help you out there. Hold on, I can't battle res you. I'm gonna have to heal myself. Move out the way, I'm going to die. Didn't have time to do a guardian spirit on myself. Yeah, that didn't work. <laughs> hey, school Shane, how are you? Um, congratulations, congratulations, I mean, happy 4th of July to you. 
Let's help Sam out. <laughs> it's a tough one, this one. 1,180 bear tartar. Um, I'm not NA, I'm EU uh, right one too. Where's my heel bot? My heel bot's just up here, but it's uh, I haven't configured it for ages, and so it's all wrong, which doesn't really help me. Right, let's resurrect. How are we doing? Right, okay, what I'm going to do... Is anyone actually making a group? Unlist my current group. Okay. Let's do that. And let's make a group up. Um, hold on. Group. Um, Pre-made groups. Custom. Start a group. Summer Dan plays. Well... Wow. List group, auto invite. There we go. If anyone wants to join in, they are more than welcome. And then I'm going to basically try and help people out if I can, whilst not getting into any tagging just yet. And then I'll see how everyone gets on. And if I can heal them, then I'll get into the combat. combat. Oh, yeah. Oh, there you are. Oh, sorry you died. Maybe I can resurrect you. Where are you? There you are. Resurrect you. Let's help you out. And then maybe I can invite you to group. No, wrong person. Hold on. Oh, no, I need to heal. Need to heal here. Hold on. There we go. Apologies if I'm not keeping up with chat. So then you, and then can we... Invite. There we go. Heal, heal. Ah, there we go. Fantastic. Awesome. Thank you very much. There we go. <laughs> right, let me catch up on chat. Thank you uh, for your help, Jack. Uh, there we go. Throw a smite and heal him. Uh, basically, you just want to know whether to sell now or hold for the pre patch boon. Oh, right. Um. Maybe do a mix of both, I think, Shantogen. It, it's, it's difficult to know how it's going to go. Um, so I would say it all depends on sort of how much of something you're trying to keep hold of it. Uh, I'll, I'll leave doing more for the moment, actually, because um, I'm already on enough of a squirrel hunt. I've got enough uh, resources now. What I'm actually going to do is I'm going to go to my garrison. So I'm going to do that instead, for now. Um, so let's do that. Oh, hold on. <laughs> Don't stand where a dragon spawns. Handy hint. Let's run out this way. <laughs> oh dear. There we go, let's just run over this way. I'll go with the goats. And I'll hide around the corner. There we go. <laughs> right, now I'll Hearthstone to Garrison. Thank you for the help. <laughs> right, let me catch up on chat. Um, better time I'll go to give the speed buff to BFA. No, I hear it's going to go down. Um, so basically, at 114.0, zero, as Costa's um, put. But is the nerf for pre patch or BFA? I don't know, Shantajin. Um, uh, it could be for BFA, I guess. Uh, Ryuka, how are you? Thanks for stopping by. Um, but there is—is is there a new speed up boost in BFA? That would be nice if there is. 
Uh, one of your best friends from England used to joke with me, unfortunately, saying you could have beaten us out and not wasted all that good tea. <laughs> hey, Mianx, how are you? Thanks for stopping by. And, um... He's behind me. <laughs> no, Beatty, you don't only get meat from skinning, just from killing animals. Not, you don't only get meat from skinning. That's a double negative, will you know? Well done. Let me work that out. M beta, you... You only get meat from... You get meat from skinning animals. Right, okay. Did they change it for skinning meat because you only got meat from skinning? Yeah, okay. Does everyone stock up on Dark Moon Fair fire water? I've got some. Um, I don't really need... have a lot, though. I could have steez. <laughs> Pardon me. Um, seems weird to only get meat from skinning. Yeah, that was a bit. That was a bit weird. It seemed like a bug, didn't it? Thank you. <laughs> Free patch is BFA talent, so everything BFA is in it. Except the new zones, no more mage tower, no more sales from there. This is true. <laughs> nice check. Um, you, are you have to kill them not to do it. Yeah. Since when have you been there? Cliff Stomper. And Crusher. And Battle Boar. Don't need to be buying mounts. Let's get the garrison resources going. Token and one of these. In English you say bless you when someone sneezes. Yes. Uh, it's a bit of a strange one. I think, I think in French it's, is it a tissue, and in German it's Gesundheit. Bless you is what the priest said before you died from the plague. <laughs> in Spanish it's Jesus. Oh, nice. Dutch too is Gesundheit. Ah, okay, that's an interesting mix. Okay, so what have we got resources wise? Um, there's a 34 there. Um, why can't I start that mission? None in progress. You have too many active followers. You Oh, you must deactivate one. Ah, so I must have got an extreme scavenger. Which one was that? How am I going to find it? You're working. Kiara. There you go. You're an extreme scavenger. Increases garrison resources gain for a mission by 200%. We don't need the pleasure bot because we've already got one. So let's deactivate you. How do we deactivate you? Inactive. Hold on. I've missed a load of stuff coming in. Hold on. Uh, da -da -da -da. Uh, hold on, God, wow, there's loads of stuff going on. Uh, <laughs> loads of chess out. Cast out demons causing sneezing diseases. <laughs> nice, Gold Queen. Very nice. You want to keep my demons? <laughs> there's a search bar on the top there. Okay, thank you, Wave. Uh, right click. Newest one's generally the lowest. Okay, right, there we go. Right click. Mission slots are filled. Okay, so if I can't right click, maybe it's this arrow. No. Followers. Ah, wrong wrong tab. There we go. That's that. There we go. Deactivate. Uh cost you 250 gold. Uh okay. Yes. Now we should have enough. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Oh, did I miss a sub? Oh, Oh no, it wasn't. It was more than that. Wow. Skull, sorry, Skull, uh, Skull Ketik, thank you ever so much for the Prime sub. And uh, JWR, thank you ever so much for the uh, donation, both of you. Thank you very much. I do apologize, I was too busy looking at my followers, but thank you both, that's extremely kind of you. 
That's very generous of you, JWR. Thank you indeed. And thank you, uh, thank you, Costa and Jack, for giving me the prompt. In Spanish, you use Jesus or salud, meaning health. Jesus one was because back in ancient times, they thought when you sneeze, you were casting out demons. Ah, okay. Right, okay, there we go. Wow. So now we can start our missions. 100%. Start. And then we might as well get a couple of those to upgrade the new followers that are going to be coming in. And then let's head down. We're going to recruit another one. Where's my chef's hat gone? I'm not wearing my chef's hat. There we go. Because I died. Uh, the leather trader. What do we need for raw beast hides? Give you 50. You're trading. I'm trying to restock your supply. Would you be willing to trade? What for? Hey, Lamekin, how are you? But I like my raw beast hides. Although Samadan does have some. So, and they get primal spirits. We've got 2,800 primal spirits. I think I'll leave those right now. Thank you, Jake the Fox. Yeah. We already have loads. I've not been using my primal spirit, so I'm going to stick with my raw beast hide. And then let's head on over to my two favorite places, full of work orders. So we'll take the hex weave from this side. That's loads of hex weave. Now, unfortunately, we can't stock up until we do some sumptuous fur farms. And here we'll get our fractured temporal crystals with thanks to uh, the Gold Queen for giving me the, the tip about that one. Reading one of your uh, blog posts. And not that one. We need to do the work orders on this because we've got the Drainic Dusts. There we go. Uh, shame that they're disabling the garrisons in BFA. Are they, is that a thing still, Shantagen, or is that a, a bug? Because it does seem really odd. Um, how long did the drain offline take? Oh, that was a good couple of months, I would say, Bully Wolf. Um, and, and that's at Samadan pace whilst doing it on stream, so, you know, it's not exactly the fastest. Um, ever thought about getting the barn set up? I have had it in the past, Jeff Brown. Um, oh, hey, B, where, how are you? Um, the garrisons in BFA are working it. Oh, excellent. Thank you, Gold Queen, for confirming it. That would be good if they did. It did. It did seem like a. Um, it did seem like a bug. Um, so we've got those. We've got the hex weave. We could possibly um, go and do another hex weave bag now. That would probably sell. Uh, switch to WoW UI. Hex weave bag. Let's create one. They're at 2,000 at the moment, so I'm going to keep on making and selling those. Um, but I think that's probably... Let's hearth back to the tavern, and then we'll carry on with um, our other characters, I think. Maybe Earthen can go and get some Sumptuous Fur in a bit. Samadan needs to go and get some Shadow Silk and possibly Ember Silk, but I don't think we'd have time for that tonight. Hey, Sergeant Rios, how are you? Thanks for stopping tonight. And Cold Trains, how are you both? Right, so we're going to go down and... Um, yeah, I bet you were relieved to see it. I, I am too, actually, because I, I like garrisons. I see no reason why they should have changed it or taken it out. Um, let's just do a post scan of what we've got. There we are. Uh, I like using garrison resources to buy stuff just for, um, from the trader. Yeah, JWR, definitely. I'm very kind of you to offer, Costa. Um, we might be able to do that. Um, let me just post this first, and then I'll be going over to um, Earthen next anyway. 
So rich purple shirt, black swashbuckler, flaked sea salt. They can all go on. Nothing else is on? No, there we go. So that's done. Let's head on back up to the top so we can log through. And then we'll switch over to Earthen and see what we're doing with the drums, actually. That would be quite handy. Uh, logged in uh, every so often to see if they fixed it. I was thinking it might have been intended. Yeah, it's a bit worrying if it hasn't been changed in a while, but thankfully, if Cold Queen's uh, saying it's done, then that's a good sign. It's back in. I see no reason why they wouldn't. Um, how you play BFA when it's not out yet? If you if you've gotten into the beta uh, Mianex, um, you can get um, most uh, quite a few people have got access now. Um, if you don't have access, you have to make sure that in your Battle.net accounts, you, you there's a tick box in your account settings somewhere that you'd like to participate in the beta program for things like this, and you have to make sure that's um, ticked, and then you'll get invites to things like this when they come out. If if you kind of like randomly can do it. Oops, wrong button. Okay, we got some expires. And well, there's 11,000 gold in there as well. So let's start with the expires. And what have we got in sales? So we've got Drums of Fury selling for 109 each. Uh, another dread leather. So dread leather is selling. I need to um, up some on that. And some more drums of fury. Okay. How often do I cancel scan? I haven't done any cancel scans at all in months, uh, Zach Tizzle. Um, it's mainly down to my server being quite a low pop one, so things can be quite slow moving. You told me so. You did indeed. I always uh, try and make sure I listen to your advice because pretty much 99.9% .9 of it's spot on. So we'll get those on. What are we left with? We've got some bear tartar still. Um, I'm left with 1,400 of it at the moment. 540s on the auction house. 560s in my bags. Let's get these drums on. There's currently 265 auctions of drums, so people have been crafting them. So let's keep mine on, keep myself at the lowest prices in uh, cure ties. I haven't looked into those yet, Costa. Um, that may be one squirrel too many for tonight, because I've still got the sumptuous fur in my head. Uh, we've got 12,000 gold though, so I'll send 10,000 of that over to Samadan. You used to do cancel scans at least once a day, but you just post auctions for 24 hours to save the time cancel scanning. Yes, that's pretty much what I do, Shantogen. Um, most of my auctions are on for 48 hours, except for the enchants, which I have on at 24 hours. For that very same reason. All right, let's get those drums and those bear tartars on. Because the main thing I want to do here is uh, potentially, I think, a sumptuous fur farm. So we've got time to do our other characters as well. So we'll just do a quick one, I think. Um, if anyone would like to join in for a, a quick sumptuous fur farm, I'm just going to send some gold to Samaden. That's 100 gold. That's 100,000 gold, one zero too many, 10,000 gold. Contacts, alts, Samadan, send. Yes. Okay, so what I'll do is I'll make a group up. Oh, it's probably best actually to see if um, anyone's over there first. Otherwise, someone else will have to make a group up and then phase into that realm. So let's head on over and see if, oh no, oh, that one, Garrison Hearthstone. There we go. 
The Contax is very good Ryoka, yeah, I really like that. Um, it kind of offsets the pain that is the, uh, the task list at the moment. Once the task list is up and running, then I, I think we're onto a winner. Right, Urfan. Oh, we've got to do sca more scavengers for Samadan. I knew there was something I'd missed there. Okay, so... Um, let's get a... Let's fly over. Oh, look at that bloom. That's beautiful. I've not seen that effect before. That looks lovely. Anyway, carry on. Uh, we know you to go to Nagrand. So much easier having flying. Twisted Ancient Elite. I think that's just a regular. Haven't touched the task list yet, but still looking forward to using it. Had a lot of potential to save so much time and headache, yeah. We share the same shard, oh, do we? So that means it would be the same, would it? I'll start, I'll start a group up. There we are. Oh, Captain Karma, thank you ever so much for the follow. Okay, one tough orc. Have a great evening yourself, and thanks for stopping by. It is a bit buggy right now. Um, it will get there. Good YouTube vid videos, keep it up. Well, thank you very much, Captain Cummins. Very kind of you. Uh, let's start up a group here. Uh, Pre-made groups, custom. Start a group. Summer down plays. Wow. Well, list group. There we go. Whilst we're flying over. First iteration is going to have issue yet. Have I gone too far? No, it's still going. Um, where's my group finder gone? I'll turn on auto accept. There we go. If people want to join in the group, they're more than welcome to. I'm just on my way over to Nagrand to see if the spot's free. Oh, I've got me Looterang as well. Where's that? Um, hold on. Oh, I put it up here. Hey, Atonement, how are you? Um, just going over here. So basically this is going to be skinning. Oh, I need some dark and fire water as well, which I've also got. Look at that. Prepared. I have both things ready on my bar there. And then... Uh, there we go. Welcome, Costa. We joined, but your NA and Horde. <laughs> Let's see now. I wish they could change that so that um, it could be cross, cross world and cross faction. Then we can all be one happy WoW family. All right. Let's have a look. Uh, toss the Lutarang on like an easy key. Oh, do I have to keep on pressing it? Uh, looks like we've got a um, horde party here at the moment. So we might have to phase to someone else and regroup on this one. Because that's going to be tricky. We're not PvP and we're not going to be able to tag those ones. So let's just move out of the way. If anyone on a different realm wants to start up a fresh group and... Um, if they're if they're phase through, just smack through it. We have more power. <laughs> okay, well I'll give that a go if that's if that's going to work. Um, hey, Pantikins, how are you? Want to buy winter? <laughs> yeah. Um. Have you started Mother's Skinning Life Quest or finished that? No, I haven't right one too. Just wait till we're there, flying above Talador still. Okay. Um, so, Lutarang needs to go on a key, does it? So... 27 degrees, still in the middle of the night. I know, it's crazy, isn't it? Doing very well, thank you, Pentagons. We're just going to do a bit of um, Lutarang... What am I going to put this on? 
I'm guessing Q, but that's a... Uh, I haven't changed it back. No, it should still be um, the, the regular sparkle thing. I'm thinking... I want this to be an easy key. Like, um, let's temporarily do it over Q. So do I have to just keep pressing it? I like that. And then spam it again. Okay, that's quite cool. And then let's drink some dark green fire water. There we go. I use GSE and put it in a macro. Okay. Use uh you scroll up if I don't have anything else. I'm not sure I'd use that one. Okay, start skinning. Hold on. Let me get in. Well, that, that works. Uh, did I drink my fire, fire water? Yes, I did. So I need to press that for the Lutarang, which is really cool. So I spam Lutarang and then skin when I can, if anyone's around. Hold on, wrong button. Oh, we're getting the sumptuous fur, which is the main thing. There's a skin. There's not much to skin. But let's do the bits we can for the raw beast hides. There's one. Alright, just get used to a new routine now. Oh, the Lutrang's really good, though. Well done. Uh, we're with everyone. Is that a skinning item? No. Okay, there we go. Right, let me just catch some chat. Uh, ben, good evening, how are you? Uh, new of in. Is it fur farming? Just for a little bit. We need to get up a little bit more fur at the moment. So we're just um, doing a quick, uh, item's not ready yet, we're doing a quick sumptuous fur farm just to get ourselves some extra bits and pieces. Not having much luck with my skinning though on this, not seeing a lot that I can skin. Maybe it's the way I'm looting. Lots of mangy pelts, oh there's a skinning. And then it disappears. That's weird. It's like I can skin and then not skin. Okay. Not everyone is looting them. Okay. Oh, forever you resubbed. Oh, thank you ever so much. Two months. Very kind of you. Everyone in the group needs to loot. Well, I'm getting the loot, so I'll keep the loot around going once I catch up on everything. I didn't get the um, the notification on that one though, weirdly. I got the one for uh, Raki GG, thank you ever so much for the follow. Sorry, I keep need to press my loot around, hold on. Too many things, there we go, oh we got a skin in there, there we go. Okay, now, now we're cooking with gas. There we are, target is tapped, there we go, skin. Oh, of course, we've got Horde here. They'll be skinning as well, won't they? That would explain it. Oh, yeah. It's loot left, and as well, um, someone else will be skinning as well at the same time. Um, oh, thank you, uh, Pop Geek, with the uh, bits. It's very kind of you. I haven't got the mother skinning knife. No, I've just literally got... Um, I've got the Lutarang and the regular skinning knife. I need to do that quest. Uh, da, 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 da. Um, Macro Priest, thank you ever so much for stopping by. Inspired you to make a farm for your alt to produce uh, produce all herbs. Okay, new, excellent. Uh, Ghost Iron Ore, yes. Okay. If you get it, it will skin the nearest mob. Oh, that would be useful in this situation where there's competition for skinning could see how that would definitely work because I'm kind of limited depending on how everyone's doing at the moment so that's definitely worth looking into 
managed to get a few raw beast hides at least. I mean, that's the main purpose here, is just getting some sumptuous fur more than anything else. There we are. Snake thingies. Ooh, what was that? Oh, there we go. The Lutrang certainly very good. That's cool. Um, you eight boxes farm, 30 stacks or so an hour. Wow, ecstasy, that's loads. Congratulations on getting that set up. That's impressive. And remember, Xmas time on the quest that gives you um, a drink. It's the same as the fire water, so stop and save them on all your alts. Okay, it's only from a quest. Oh, right. Okay, I'll look out for that one. I'll probably forget by Christmas, but it's worth a... Uh, Worth remembering. Oh, there's one. Get a skin in on that one. Got some primal spirits there. Thankfully, I'm not that efficient with this, so other people can at least get a chance for some stuff. Don't want to uh, deprive the horde of their loot as well at the same time. Uh, get your link and you can note down in my board thing, maybe. That's a good idea, uh, write one too. Very good idea. Right, how much have we got sumptuous fur-wise at the moment? 146. So I'll go up to a stack. And then I'll move on to my other characters, I think. A black rock coffee, okay. Helps the hordes. Well, exactly. I mean, you know, we did we did muscle in on their patch, so um, I think me being slightly inefficient and giving them a chance to skin and loot at the same time is the only fair way I could think of of sharing the same spot. And then I'll skin a few, they can skin a few. doesn't share. <laughs> We're preparing for war, Samadan, and you want to give the Horde their fair share. It's because people like you, they'll be strong enough to fight and kill so many of our citizens. I can see the logic there, but I can also counter that logic with, you know, if there was more kindness and understanding in the world, then there wouldn't be a war in the first place. Am I selling drums? Uh, definitely, uh, Bully Wolf, they're selling really well. Um, the price has ranged from as high as 262. They're currently selling for about 100 gold each on my server, which I think is really nice. For Azeroth. <laughs> for the horse. <laughs> that too. For all the wildlife. For the squirrels and the hedgehogs in this world. Okay, so it's, anyone. it's one person to fudge everything up. Hell scream anyone? Yeah. That's the that's the issue, isn't it? Let's go over here. See if we can help out over here. Do this one over here. Get some more beast hide there. Loot those. Oh, there's a skinning option there. Looterang a few more things. There we go. Let's find it. It's this one. Fizzy apple cider. Ah, oh, okay. Well, it sounds like a fun drink, if nothing else. I don't remember because I wasn't. Um, I didn't. I've only got the uh, what I've read about the um, the Garrosh storyline. I'm not sure how he quite how it all worked out. Let's loot that one. Use my loot ring again. Let's 
There we go. The Pasture's Gift Pack. Okay. No one got the LFG comic reference. Um, I can't rem I remember LFG comic, but I don't remember the, the one you're talking about, Shantidun. There's more fur. Um, remember because you had so many alts doing quests, you had loads of them saved, saved them and still had loads to use for farming. Okay. And if you want everyone to be friends, you may as well say... May as well just play My Little Pony. There's an idea. <laughs> well, the thing is, it's... I... It is a... There is PvP, but it's also very much a PvE game. You know, player versus the environment. And there's plenty of things and um, enemies to be de dealing with. Um, I thought EverQuest handled it quite well. In that you could um, PvE with anyone... Um, but certain races weren't welcome in certain cities, so um, the guards, the, the NPC guards would kill um, the Ixar lizard people, but um, humans would be okay. But you could still group up with an Ixar if you wanted to, which I thought was really cool. Our small flit's worth a fine, buying 11 items for 170 and reposting for 299. Oh, that sounds like a decent amount, Macro Beast, I think. Um, I would I would go with that amount, certainly. Because what, even once you take the auction house cut into account, um, it depends how easily and quickly you can buy them. But um, yeah, that, that should be uh, should be doable, certainly. Depends on how quickly they sell for. If you liked on Age of Conan, the RP service, you could PvP anyone, so you murdered anyone who didn't RP. Okay. That's quite extreme, though. I don't think I'd enjoy that. Um, allow for cross-faction working and even uh, defacting to the other. Yeah, that would be nice, Ryoko. I'd like that. All right, I'm not looting. Hold on. Let me just get in on the looting. There you go. There was the year uh, that Major WoW website for April Fools changed the site to a Hello Kitty one. <laughs> There's a Winter Spring Cub Fender. <laughs> Sounds awesome, Jack. Yeah, the, uh, there's loads of uh, there's loads of hidden vendors all over the place. What's that add-on? Is it Nikorn vendors or something that shows you where all the rare single things are? Right, how am I doing on Sumptuous Fur? Let me just have a look. Okay, I've got 300, so I think that should do me for now. Uh, thank you all for the group. I'm going to skedaddle out of this one and carry on with my other characters for the end. But thank you all. Very kind of you to help out. Um, I'm going to leave the group and then I'll half over. Hold on, I'll move over here. If you want to carry on doing the... Um, If you want to carry on doing the farm, you're more than welcome to, obviously. And I'm going to hearth back instead. There we go. Uh, so children on Garrosh, uh, drunk with power, he tried to have Vol'jin assassinated. Okay. Um, did a bunch of bad things. Thrall and Vol'jin aid the alliance on the siege of Orgrimmar. And then he travels in time to Draenor uh, to form the Iron Horde. See, that's the, that's the bit that confused me, the whole time travel bit. That was all a bit weird. Because um, I, I would never know who's the real person from which zone. Like, who came from that time zone and who came from this one? Like, is there two of everyone? I haven't been doing this as long as some of us, yeah. I had, I had a very big gap in the middle. Some of us have... Uh, some of us have some ancient secrets. <laughs> yeah, I can imagine. I want to focus on different vendors if there's one yet. Okay. Uh, old lady's voice. <laughs> Probably wasn't in the goal making parts then. Yeah. Yeah, no, I didn't. Um, back in vanilla, I wasn't doing the goal making side of things. Um, I used uh, Auctioneer. Um, just to post a few things on, but that was that was about it back then. Uh, let's get rid of all the junk. 
and then I'm going to send the fur over to Samadan. Some will have to bring you to the dark side and hex you just to share with you. <laughs> right, sumptuous fur, drag in there, drag in there, and then contacts, alts, Samadan, send. I could set up a group for that, but um, we do get a few things here that have a good vendor sell price. There's a few things there that have a decent um, actual price there. Region market of 6,700. That's not bad. Uh, you started in Wrath of Lich King making gold, linking epic armour and weapons from the auction house to sell for more. Oh, and then I remember you saying you used to go and buy it and then sell it to the person. You vendor in greens. <laughs> there may be some. Um, he was aided by bronze dragon fight dragon, but essentially the way the storyline goes, like looking at alternate universe, because Garrosh goes back in time and the timeline splits to a world where Garrosh leads the Iron Hold. Okay, thank you, Shantajin. It was confusing. Um, uh, Risa Rocker, how are you? <laughs> Don't worry, uh, Gold Queen. I'll at least have a look at them before I vendor them. Anything under, um, I mean, something over a thousand, I'd be tempted to uh, stick on. And that one for six thousand, I'm definitely going to stick on. And then the rest, I'll probably vendor because they move so slowly um, for me on this server. There's such occasional sales. So we're going to go down and. Okay, so the pandas wanted Garrosh to stand trial instead of letting the Horde or Alliance slaughter him. Um, in SOO, a bronze dragon uh, freed Garrosh and used his time wizardry to open the portal up to drain up before the Legion corrupted them. Garrosh went through and helped them resist the Legion and all that. At that time, he met his father before he had fathered Garrosh. Now that's, that's confusing. Thrall ends up fighting him and killing him. Okay. I have done, there is, uh, there was a cinematic I did see um, whilst I was doing the quest line for Warlords of Draenor. Um, that was quite nice, but I didn't connect it all together. And I haven't seen the um, the trial. I haven't seen any Pandaria end things. The Warlords of Draenor one. SOO, Siege of Orgrimmar Raid. Ah, okay, thank you, right one too. It was in the book. I mean, I've got, I have got a book that gives me the visual guide and it does tell me some of this stuff but um i always had tr it was only sort of like a, it's a dk um visual guide so it's, it's not much on the storyline i might go and have to uh, buy the books and read those that sounds like it might be fun okay so we're gonna make a group for the we're gonna add to our group Old World region drops and put on those things that were a decent price. So, not that one. That one seems a good price. And what's next? This one for 6,700 seems a good price. That one's 3,000. That's a wand though. No one's going to buy a wand. Um, and then that one, a robe. Is 1,900. Okay, I'll add those three in. There we are. With the background downloader doing its thing, do you think the patch is next week or still uh, the following? Don't know, right one, two. It's anyone's guess, really. You know, it's in, into the hands of Blizzard. The trial wasn't shown, just the end of Siege of Orkmar. Uh, Tensu came along and said the pandas would uh, detain him as a neutral faction who had suffered as well. Okay, Draenor arrived without any in-game cinematic of his escape. Okay. Uh, Heeks, how are you? Thanks for stopping by. Doing very well, thank you very much. We're just uh, catching up on some lore that I missed in uh, Pandaria and Walls of Draenor. What's that? It's nerve-wracking. <laughs> Taking bets. No, I'm, I, I'll, it will come when it comes. How's it going with my Death Knight? Um, my Death Knight is level 81 now. I'm really enjoying um, just casually strolling through Pandaria now. 
So I'm not focusing so much on the leveling now that I'm at 80 and got to where I want to be with the mining and the um, and the level that I'm at. So I'll, I'll just see how that goes. All right, let's post those three on. You could probably do with making some dread leather. Um, but I'm kind of need to get some more bloods for that. Oh, there's a link there. I haven't seen that, Shantajin. Oh, that's for the pony comment. Okay, I'll have a look at that one later. BFA can't come fast enough. Yeah, um, I'm, I'm looking forward to it, but I've still got so much more to do. Um, so I'm just kind of uh, carrying on with my gold making. I think what I'll do is I'll... Where are we at time-wise? Yeah, well, let's swap over to the next character. See, I don't get enough time to do everything I want to do in one day. Like Costa was saying, 10 hours you could really do with just to get through all your characters. You could wait. Expenses always come too fast to you. Yeah, I, I get that right one too. I'm, I'm kind of similar. You're so bad at making gold to just end up picking flowers. Hey, that... That still works. Um, Puzz? Do you mind me calling you Puzz? Uh, what have we got here? An empty mailbox. Oh no, because that's on sending. <laughs> Wrong one. Aha! 22,000 gold on Joakening. Excellent. Uh, must have... You just have two accounts, then you can get through all the stuff. Yeah, that's not bad, uh, Misty. Uh, there we go, some sales of living steel. Um, one of four, one of two. Someone's bought the potions of treasure finding. That's nice. Um, and then River's Heart is sold as well. Excellent, excellent. Uh, Zach Tizzle. Oh, thank you ever so much for the sub. And Pulsar for the follow. Thank you ever so much for your support. Thank you indeed. Yeah, there's absolutely loads to do. Um, and I'm never going to ever have enough time to do it all. So I'm just going to make do with what I have. Um, and make gold and have fun in, in the meantime. So there we go. Um, no worries, Shantajin. It's absolutely not necessary at all. But... Just being here and um, adding your adding your name to the list is uh, more than enough. It gets, you know, it's... For me, uh, whilst I'm in the middle of this partner application, it's all about the viewer averages at the moment. So everyone who's here is all contributing. So thank you everyone for just being here. Want to buy payday, <laughs> yeah. Um, mainly want your profs past uh, 700, at least the hunter. Uh, run through Mesa. That's not bad um, target to go for, Ryoko. I mean, I think um, as many professions as you can to 700 would be good, definitely. You stick to three characters. One's your main gold maker, one's your farmer, and one's a crafter. That's a good mix, actually. Oh, thank you. 94 already. Yeah, it's... Uh, the trick is, it has to stay at that for quite a while to counter the average you get when you start a stream. Um, because you go from zero up to whatever figure it is, as people know you're on. And because I don't stream for a long time, it's like two hours rather than sort of like four or five hours that a lot of people do. Um, it has to get up quite high quite quickly. No problem, Lizard Well. Glad others could benefit from it. Um, and apologies for the slurp there. So... We've got some expires. Let's have a look what else we had on the auction house for Awakening. Uh, anything about to expire? No, there's nothing on. So let's post on what we've got and then we'll work out what we need to make or what we can make. See if there's anything we can buy or anything that um, El Morte can send over to help out with. Let's have a look. Um, you have every profession covered with 12 one tens. Yeah, that's nice. Very nice. Um, just need to level all of them. Um, don't worry with the double stack profs so much. Just get one at least. But yeah, I mean, that's a really good position to be in. 
Um, I'm sure by another expansion or two I'll be in a similar position. Um, because I've got obviously catching up of time to do, but um, I'm 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 hopeful. That's for sure. Um, so those are done. Okay. Uh, Puzz, thank you ever so much for the follow. Very kind of you. Um, what can we actually make alchemy-wise? Let's have a look. Let's switch to the standard one whilst we just work out everything. I haven't fully set up groups and crafting groups for these. I'm using uh, what I have here to, to help me out mainly. Uh, you'll get there. Definitely tell uh, you that Sharkin promotes you every day and don't blame him. Oh, he's very, very kind as Sharkin. Uh, gathering for the first week, uh, then get ahead with one of the crafting. Uh, scrapper will help a little. Yeah, I don't know much about the scrapper yet, but that's definitely um, an interesting uh, aspect of it, being able to break down items. Um, but yes, that's what I heard as well, um, Gold Queen. It was uh, Eclipse who was talking about it earlier today on his stream, about doing gathering first, and then he said moving into cloth, um, and then crafts, and then... I think potions and stuff before the raid comes out um, and then engineering I think he said I can't remember exactly oh, I can make some living steel which what's living steel at the moment moment 2000 okay and the pyrium we haven't actually sold much pyrium and we do have how many have we got 11 we're not posting the pyrium hold on why aren't we posting the pyrium? Because the crafting cost... That's a massive profit. Hold on, let's just check pyrium. Something's wrong with that. Let's run a post scan. Um, oh, let's catch up on chat. Hold on. Um, still don't get the scrapper yet. Haven't read much. Um, no, I haven't either, Heeks. I, I, need to, um, I need to look into it myself. You want Teldrassil Sprout from Black Market for 2.7k? Nice. Is that a pet, do you have him? Um, your main is a skin leather working, so we're focusing on that initially. Uh, get some revenue, but the Druid will be coming straight after from the Mine and Herbs. That's a good idea, yeah. It's like the Obliterum Forge. You get crafting mats returned, uh, plus chance to get Expulsum. Aha, okay. And Expulsum's the new Blood of Sargeras. Instead of getting a blitter and dust, you get a random chance for a bind on pickup item. Okay. Maybe make it into true gold. The um, the pyrium. Yeah, that's a good idea actually. Um, what can I do with that? Um, someone said it earlier, but if you are like the Bob Ross, <laughs> very good at what you do. Very calm, collected, helping people. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Happy little gold trees. I like that one. Um. Oh, look, someone's saying, I am st am I streaming? Uh, yep. There we are. Uh, buy and pick up Expulsum, need to be crafting. There we go. Uh, you like that the Scrapper uh, will give actual crafting mats. Yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing what it does. Uh, it's a pet, okay. Uh, listing on around for 70k. Oh, very nice. Uh, so 2.7 is really cool. Was it 2.7 or 27? Always relaxing whilst you farm. <laughs> Thank you. It even has the Blitter and Forge sound files. I wonder if those are placeholders, Gold Queen, or whether they're going to have their own ones in there. Transmute Shuffle is a head racket to get used to when you first get used to it. Yeah, definitely. 2,700. Very nice. Very nice indeed. So, looking at that... Um, the, oh yes, the pyrene bars weren't in there because um, I would be making that into true gold, which I don't have volatile water for. So I need to do a search for some volatile water. That's why I can't make true gold. So shopping. Let's start with, okay, volatiles. Run shopping scan. Alchemy Transmute Master List. Yeah, exactly. That's what got me started on it. Um, Jack's very good uh, list. 
<laughs> Some fans everywhere now. <laughs> I always find that funny when people are on the uh, in in game and the chat. Hey Naraxius, how are you? Thanks for stopping by. Um, so we needed a volatile water over anything else. So how much have we got here? Um, that's below my, what's my average buy? 70 gold. So under 70 gold. There's 10 lots of 10. I'm going to take those to start me off with. Uh, had to look through that. Definitely helped. Um, all good now. Just remembering how it all over the place was to start is embarrassing. <laughs> yep, that's exactly where I was at as well. Um, I still am in many ways actually. With Jax and the real-time board that I made that helps me sort of get my head around it. So I'm kind of, a, kind of a visual person when it comes to things like that. Um, so I do need to have some pretty pictures to go with it. Um, what do I want? Everything to do with... up to 65 I think I'll take. That should get me a few. It will come, yeah, I'm pretty sure over time. So 116, 222, only 33 Earths at a purchase price of 581, so that's a little bit higher. Life we got lots of, fire we're low on. Let's get a few Earths that are the slightly cheaper price just so that we can uh, balance that out a bit. Everything up to nine gold I'm gonna take. There we go, let's collect that up and then see what we're at from the true gold front. See how much we can make and what kind of profits they're gonna be. I think uh, TSM mailing's quicker. The new TSM mailing is definitely quicker even on Mr. Potato. Okay, so true gold, we can make three because of our Pyrian bars. So actually, I'm gonna use my daily cooldown to make some more Pyrian bars. And then we can make, we're still missing, oh, because of the fire. Let's have a look at the fire. Transmute eternal air to water. Oh, that's cool. A new transmutation. Volatiles. And shopping scan again. So we need some more fire. What's my average? Oh, fire is expensive actually. Although, saying that, my purchase price is ridiculously low at three gold. It's not going to be that, is it? So let's get some. Let's. What would be a normal price, I wonder? Where's the uh, region? Region market value is 53. So 65 is slightly high. And we could obviously go farming for these. This is another thing I haven't farmed yet. Um, farming for volatiles. I know it's been on my list for a while. Um, so I'm going to take just a few. I'm not going to get that 100 because that's going to be very expensive. I don't think I could afford it. But I'll take just these ones to get me going on my true gold. There we are. Pick those up. And then we can have a look at what we can make. Or how many we can make. And Alchemy says we can make five. Okay, so let's hope for some procs. One true gold. Two true gold. There's a proc. Two. Okay, we've got one proc. There we are. Check for Saronite as well, bars and ore. Okay, Jack, and what's the Saronite used for? Shopping Saronite. Saronite bar is 13 gold at 28% value. Region is more like 51? Bye, bye. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay, I'll get the seven. 
and I'll get the 15. Do I want it at 46 as well? For the Saronite bars? There's quite a few of them. I mean, that is region. No. How's the Saronite ore itself, though? That was the bars. There's ore nuggets. You can but test it out for now. Okay, so what's the Saronite used for? Is it uh, an alchemy thing? Um, let's have a look. What uses Saronite? The titanium. Okay. Transmute titanium. So that's obviously we didn't, we got it at the purchase price. So what you're saying in the mat cost is 40. Um, and then there's a profit there, titanium ore times two, a profit of 42 gold for titanium bars. So you can sell the titanium bar or trans, oh right, so this goes back to, see now, Part of me is thinking that Jawakening should not be a herbalist, but should be a miner. Just to put these two, Transmute and Mining, together. Q-tip, F-Q-tip, thank you ever so much for the follow. There we go. So we've got those. Yes, as a transmute mi master, mining is better. You have a minor transmute guy, yeah. You changed it last month. Yeah, I've, I've got a feeling, I've got a feeling Jawakening would be able to then, to save the sort of swapping over. Um, that may be something to consider because herbalism isn't that difficult to, I know we spent all that time with the seed raids and everything, um, but using the garrisons and stuff, it's not that difficult to level up. You don't see the follows anymore. That's weird. It should be popping up though. I'm going to have to have a look at my uh, Streamlabs extension. It seems to be a little bit weird at the moment. Uh, to transmute titanium. Let's create the three here. Will we get procs for these? No, none on there. Um, any more treasure finding? We're missing heart blossom. Oh, there looks like there might be some cheap on still. Let's go have a look. Heart Blossom. Any Heart Blossom? Let's have a look. Um, I haven't arranged to do one. Um, how do I best use the garrison to level herbling? Um, oh, you don't get it in chat. Okay. That's weird. Yeah, that should that should pop up. Um, I'm very close to 2,000 follows on both Twitch and YouTube, um, so I think I might skip straight past it because I I don't I haven't really organised a, a giveaway for that yet. Um, I might go for a higher number, um, but I haven't worked it out yet. Um, I need I need some more thought on that one. But that heart blossom, there's only one, but I don't know. There's another four there. I'll buy those. And I'll buy those three. And I mean that one. At, oh no, that's a different thing. Um, one eight nine seven. Yeah, it's very close. It seems to be going up really rapidly at the moment, which is awesome. So thank you everyone who's following at the moment. It's really appreciated. So if I buy this heart bottom, I know I'm going back and forth between the mailbox quite a lot here, but I'm doing it in small. Um. I heard but did not loot and uh, got a skill point. Yes, I remember seeing that as well. It was um, Eclipse, wasn't it, Ignis? Um, I was watching his stream earlier. Just afraid to ask. <laughs> yes, I think he did. Um, he, he, he did the clicked on it and then got the skill up but didn't loot. And then went over and did the mining for a bit, and then went back and forth between the mining and the herbalism, because he was doing skilling up both. That seemed to work for him. But yeah, you don't loot the stuff, so that's kind of um, 
Potion of treasure finding, crafting cost 342, three, so let's create one and see if we can sell that one as well. Okay, so let's post that on. Um, transmute stuff we haven't actually looked shopping wise. Um, yeah, I don't think uh, I don't think you could get the seeds or anything. Um, how do you check if your alchemist is a transmute master? Uh, spellbook minibar. Okay. Right. Might try that through, uh, though, debating just sticking to Legion for the quest jobs. I mean, that's the good thing, Gary, is you can do it with Legion at the moment. Obviously, is that that's going to change, obviously, when things go out. Uh, Ghost Iron, Elementium, Pyrium. Okay, that's all expensive. Uh, how's the spirits looking at the moment? Uh, that's all looking expensive. And the panther stuff. How's that looking? Anything? Golden Lotus is the expensive one. Ah, see, I've run out of time again to be able to do some more. There's a lot of stuff missing here, actually. A lot of stuff missing. Well, I posted on what I can. Uh, yes, let's have a look. Um, oh, you said the spell tab, didn't you? Uh, spell book and abilities. Professions, alchemy. It says up here, transmutation master. Allows an alchemist to sometimes get greater results when transmuting materials. And I can unlearn the specialization. That's cool. I did it in Orgrimmar, which is a bit weird saying that as a worgen, but I don't know where you do it um, on the alliance side. Alright, uh, that's all that, that's all that. Um, do we want to send any gold over? 1,000, no, 16,000. Let's do 10,000. Intrepid Muppet, thank you ever so much for the follow. So that's popped up there, that's come up there. Now will it come up in chat? It should do. But if it doesn't, I'll have to see if I can fix that. But thank you ever so much. Uh, Intrepid for the follow. So let's send some money over um, to Samadan. Contacts, alts, Samadan. Amount. Let's do 10,000 again, I think. That's 10. I'm sure I've got not enough zeros in. That's 1,000. I'll get that right at some point. Uh, so send mail to Samadan. Yes. Oh, we haven't checked El Morte yet. Let's do El Morte as well. See if he's sold any of his bars. And you can pick one of the three master masteries, yeah. You're going to test something in the stream. Okay, Jack. Please don't break it. <laughs> Adcom B tag test. B tag. Yep, those are those are commands I haven't set up on my um, on my bot, Nightbot that does the the Streamlabs chatbot, not Nightbot. Right, El Morte, last one. Uh, you got nine hundred and forty-five gold. Ooh, that's nice. Uh, thank you. Uh, I think it was Evil Dinner that did. Uh, Gifted me a bronze whelping. That's sold. Fantastic. And the expire of the quail and cobalt tin and more cobalt sold. So that's 13,000. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Um, do I want to do anything here at the moment? I'm not sure I can do a lot at the moment. I haven't been buying anything. Or collecting anything up. It's not tin, I'll leave. Okay, we've run out of time for doing stuff with El Morte anyway. Uh, send the Saronite to Jawakening. Um, did I have some Saronite on this one? It was the other. Uh, oh, this one. Yes, Saronite bars, yes. Okay. 
So I'm going to have to set up a TSM mailing operation for this. Um, send. Oh yeah. Get this sorted properly. Then I can just go into the groups and send stuff. There we go. Okay, and we want to send some gold to Samadan. I think I'll do another 10,000 to Samadan. Leave you with 4,500. There we go. And send that. Right, well, Samadan should get some nice mailboxes for that. So let's swap over to him now and have a look. Yeah, you don't... Do, 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 don't loot anything. When doing it. I haven't tested it myself yet. I don't know how it works. But... Uh, oh yeah, we're on the top, aren't we? And down we go. And let's open up the mail. Bags off. Inbox. So we've got 30,000 from everyone, plus the sumptuous fur, which you could probably do with setting up those, but we'll leave those at the moment. Plus we've got the sales of the uh, um, rings. I mean, these are all under a thousand, which is really low, but okay, let's pick those up. If you type the, with a G on the end, it will keep it. Ah, oh, thank you, Blissic Monkey. I was wondering why um, it wasn't working out so well. Thank you. It thinks I'm doing uh, 10,000 copper, since that's the default. Aha, thank you, that makes perfect sense. So let's have a look at Samadan. 2,596,000. Oh, we've got a uh, Bloodhunter's Quarry there. Oh, five Bloods as well. And a weapon enhancement. And we'll add that on to someone who's just freshly up, like you. There we go. And that we'll use up on some dark zealots. That clears up some space. Right. <clears throat> Oops, wrong button. Well, okay. Well, I think I pretty much ran through the characters there. I didn't get quite as much done as I wanted to get done. Uh, let's have a look at the chart and put in our numbers for tonight. So, coming down here for tonight's gold, 2,596,971. Apologies, I'm going a bit croaky. <clears throat> so that's... Um, about 40,000, but that doesn't make up for yesterday's loss. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right, okay. So we're still below. Hopefully, hopefully, if um, pre patch hits, we'll get some really uh, interesting people coming in and buying all my stuff and leveling up things or doing different things. So it's going to be a good one to keep an eye on the market. There's still more I can do. Um, there's some farms I still haven't done. So I need the Shadow Silk. I need the Ember Silk. Um, I need to do some more Sumptuous Fur. And then Volatiles as well. So there's plenty of things to be doing. But that's me done for time tonight. Um, Eichenberg, thank you ever so much for the follow. Um, <clears throat> what server do I play on? Um, oh, thank you, Jack, for the chart command. Uh, hopefully that will come through. Um, I play on Shadowsong on EU. Uh, it's a pretty low-pop server. Um, we got some some nice nice parts of it. Oh, it looks like the chart's not working either. Something's wrong with my bot. Hmm. Okay. It looks like it's not connected. So something's wrong there with the stream, stream chat bot. 
Okay, I'm going to have to fix that. But thank you for trying it out, Jack. Right, okay, let's have a look, see if we can find someone to host and pass on the love to. Um, who have we got? Who's on? Um, it looks like... No, nope, not even that one. Oh, no. <laughs> I think I'm going to throw a um, host over to Reckles, Want to Buy Gold, because I haven't thrown him a host before. Even the most important one. Right, I'm going to mute that. Okay. Not even any dipping, Jack. Tragedy. Right, I'll get that sorted and I'll get that fixed for the next stream. I um do I do I take gives on your server if they serve them. Uh, thank you, Jack. <laughs> um fixed it. <laughs> Good copy and paste. Um gifts. Uh yes, I think so. Uh and thank you. Um, thank you, uh, Nabo P, for the follow. Uh, gifts. I think. I think if it doesn't upset with the challenge too much, I would. I would certainly. I'd certainly take those. Uh, thank you, Clatha. It's very kind of you to think of me. Um, the thing is to, for me, I want to. I want to still have this challenge to be a challenge um, for other people to be able to follow on with a realistic sort of same sort of schedule as me and the same amount of abilities um, so it would it would be very easy to write it off if someone said oh he got given a million and you know that's why he was able to do it um, so not that I'm suggesting people do but um, for me it's kind of like it's part of the challenge to keep it authentic as much as I can but, but thank you okay so I'm going to close up there um, thank you everyone for hanging out in chat tonight and all your support and everything uh, all the bits, the cheers, the donations the follows, just being here and all your help in chat has been absolutely amazing so thank you all um, I'm next on tomorrow there is a chance that I might not be able to because um, there may be family stuff coming up so if I'm not able to come on tomorrow I'll post it out on Twitter and Discord um, so I shall see you then hopefully um, let's throw a host over to Reckles uh, slash want to buy gold there we are so thank you all, have a great rest of your evening and I'll see you very soon in the meantime, happy gold making <laughs>